What's up, everyone? Welcome to this day in Philly sports history for September 24th, 2022. And we have now won three games in a row since Back to the Future posted about the 64 Phillies. That means if you haven't listened yet, you need to go listen. Don't be the reason why the Phillies lose today. But they now are a half game up for the second wild card spot because the Padres lost last night. And still two games up on the Brewers, which in turn is a three game lead because of the tiebreaker. So as it stands today, they would play the Braves in the first round, which I think they're 500 so far with two games left to play. We'll see. I think either way, they definitely are in a competitive match or game or match up if it's Cardinals or the Braves. So we shall see, but knock on wood, they're, they're still hanging strong and actually looked pretty good last night doing so. So today we're going to go back again to the 2017 Eagles season. And on this day, the Eagles beat the Giants 27-24 to go to 2-1. This was a very, very fun game and to me a very underrated game in that season that they went to the Super Bowl. I feel this was the kind of the jump off point or, or the catalyst because after this game, they, they rolled. They had come in, they had lost to the Chiefs the week before. Um, so still wasn't looking like they were going to go to the Super Bowl. But in this game, they were leading 14 nothing going into the fourth quarter. Um, Giants scored three straight touchdowns to take the lead. Eagles came back with a touchdown and a field goal. Uh, Giants had another touchdown and a field goal. Um, so it was 24-24. Eagles got the ball. Carson Wentz moved them close enough for Doug Peterson to attempt a 61-yard field goal. And Jake Elliott, who they had just signed the week before, um, uh, Kicked the field goal, one had just enough leg to clear it, and I remember that place went nuts, and little did we know we were in for a special rest of the season after that, but I just remember being like, hey, this th he made it, let's move on, because I've been at games where the Eagles had big leads going into the fourth quarter, and there was one time Eli Manning just exploded. We were actually walking out and had to go back to our seats because um, – he sent it into overtime. So, but this day in Philly sports history, Eagles 27, Giants 24, Jake Elliott 61 yard field goal in that Super Bowl season. Like I said, that to me was the catalyst that sparked that team that year because they just rolled after that. Uh, Phillies still hanging on and go have your guys sell, have yourself, if I can talk, go have yourselves a Saturday. And until next time, I'll see you when I see you.